You could not live with your own failure. Where did that bring you? Back to me. Bravo 6. Going dark. Impressive. Already classic, classic star here. Blue buff into invade. I'm against the Nocturne in this game. Max in Q seconds so I can jump. <laughs> I will. No backstab. <laughs> where's the Nocturne man? Where, where's the Nocturne man? Have you seen a Nocturne man? Have you seen an alien, please? Oh, he's at the chickens, man. He's at the chickens. I'm stuck. Oh my god, stop, bro. I'm stuck. Look at this dude. <laughs> fight back! Fight back! Motherfucker, crazy. Nice, let's go. Well played. Kiss. That's a ban. Shut the f. I'm truly like so sorry. I'm chilling in the streets. Hey, hey, chill, chill. <laughs> Classic minion smite. Oh shit, we don't have the damage, man. Fight back! Fight back! <laughs> Oh shit, boy. I guess we got away, boy. Holy shit, bro. Holy shit, bro. Ooh. Double kill? Question mark? Fight back! Fight back! Yo, this bitch is nuts, bro. Oh, you want some? You want some? Holy shit. I told you that bitch crazy. Okay, uh, the meta changed. Shaco got fucking nerfed. So it's time for the Iron Whip spike. Now it's kind of squishy early game, he never backed off, so I'm gonna gank his ass. He has no words either. Oof, he's kind of dead. Requiescat in pace. Kind of sucks cause we lose, that we're losing the bot lane because the bot lane... It's usually better bot lane wins the game, so fucking rip. I need to go back to base, buy boots, get a sheen as well if I can. Boots and then a control ward. So the idea of the new build, the idea with this new build is kind of that you want to combine the Iron, Spike, Whip and Stride Breaker with the Essence River. I guess it kind of depends, you can build it however you like, but I like to get the Sheen early because it just gives a lot of power. Probably have no wards. Yeah, they don't have any wards. Now I can gang like a big boy. This guy missed. Quality box. Jin died. Request cut in pace. She's so fucking dead. <laughs> He's gonna die as well. <sighs> fucking rip. I knew he was gonna ult me, but I really want to kill the owner. And I didn't really trust my E damage. Nocturne's not the most OP champ right now, but he's super fucking abused still i should be able to 1v1 him unless he he uses the bullshit fear cast on me because if he does that and i ult that she'll stay on me and he'll be able to tell which one's the real one that's the only thing you gotta watch out against nocturne so i can jump from here i don't have my ult but it's okay If Nocturne shows up, I'm gonna be kind of fucked, but I like to take the risk. Orc is not that strong, oh my god. Orc is not that strong, Orc is not that strong, Orc is not that strong. Holy fuck. <laughs> 
20 minutes later. I don't have shit up, but hey. Oh boy. At least I stole the Drake. Fire, Earth. Bodlin is hinting. What a fucking classic. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Thought Nocturn was topside, which was my mistake. Also, Nar can tell which one's the real one. If he has his W on you with like two stacks and then you ult, the clone won't have the stacks and you'll have them. So after he proked his W on me, that's when I was the ult. Burger. Okay, it's not mid. Why are you running? Hey bro, watch your jet. Watch your jet, bro. Watch your jet. What's up, man? My classes. I can't see without them. Okay, I got a fast recall. I got the essence river, and I'm looking for the Drake. It's gonna be up in 30. Maybe if we can catch someone off guard, it's gonna be perfect. The problem is the Corky has the package, so that kind of sucks. And Nocturne is super healthy. Yeah, we can catch that Corky off guard if if Brom stands him. You can always trust the Brom. Yeah, wasted his package. Perfect. Dodge this bitch's ult. Yeah, Cork is dead. GG. Also can use the Herald mid. I'm going for the Drake instead. Okay, we're doing quite fine. That fight was perfect. Like you see, that's where the Stride Breaker shines when you try to deny someone from backing off. Like in this instance. Oh, that was a bit of an overkill. Okay, I gotta fuck off. My Oof. Miss me with that gay shit! Dodge that shit. Bomb has been planted. <laughs> and now I'm out. Got my clone back just in case. <laughs> I got a lot of armor, so I'm gonna go for... I mean, not necessarily a lot of armor, but they're, they're super healthy. So I'm going for the Lord Dominics in this instance. Like, they have no one that I can really one-shot. Even this guy. <laughs> Fucking classic meta, man. Everyone that's like a bit squishy, they straight up go for tanky fucking items. Two flashes, let's go. One, bitch! I denied the no... Never mind. Rip Jin. I tried my best, but... I can easily one shot. I mean, not one shot the core cube, but I can easily disable him. There he goes. Maybe we can group around the bat on that guy's bot lane. Yeah, there. There she goes. Actually, they're fighting mid. Another flash. Yeah, it's GG. Kale just destroyed them, honestly. That guy's just sleeping for no reason. Look at that shit. Oh, Holy smokes. Holy shit. Yo, I told you. I told you about that, Kale. Samira, what's up, bro? Okay, let's see. Thank you. One, oh, three. Amogus. Actually, I wasted a clone. I was afraid he would ult me. Yep, there she goes. She doesn't give a shit. If you want to know exactly where the enemy wave is, just look at your wave. Because, you know, obviously the waves are gonna spawn at the same time. So if your wave is right there, the enemy wave is gonna be right there as well, you know? And it's the same on both sides. Kale finally recognizing the jungler's effort. Let's go. Okay. Oh shit. Kale is dead. That's not good. Anyway. Maybe I can take uh, both in hips. I'm looking for the Samira. Or Samira. Yep, she's fucking dead. 
assist. Yo, son, man. Yo, let's go, bro. It is easy, see? Oh my god, dude. I, I was expecting him to do the fucking castle. He just dropped me. Okay, let's see. Can I fuck the scorekeeper up? Bravo 6. I'm going dark. Hey, we, we might actually lose the Drake as I fucking entered. Yeah, we lost the Drake. <laughs> yeah, boy. Run, bitch! Run! Like, Shaco falls off so fucking hard late game. It feels so bad. Like, this piece of shit won't be one needed. Yeah, the game is over. Rip. Can I kill him now? Nope. Well, at least I got a plus 50. But anyways, as you can see guys from these games, the Stride Breaker build is quite solid. Just to go real quick over it at the end, when it comes to the runes here are on the screen, you wanna go for Hell of Blades and so on and so forth. And to go real quick over the build order, you want to go for Iron Whip, Spike or whatever the fuck that item is called. Then you want to get Sheen, then complete the Stride Breaker, then go for Essence Reaver. Meanwhile, when it comes to boots, you want to go for the Berserker's Greaves, but I would usually recommend you guys to build the boots in between the Iron Whip and the Sheen. Then for a fourth item, you can pretty much go for anything. I built an Overly Quick Blade, you can even go for the Collector if you really want to. Infinity Age is a good choice. Actually, Lord Dominus Regards is a perfect choice for a fourth item, especially if the enemy team is just a big tank or they're healthy or they have, you know, champions that can genuinely fight you and that it's hard for you to heal. Again, Infinity Edge is also a good choice, and if they have a lot of healing, you can even go for a Mortal Reminder. Also, always remember to buy Oracle Lances after your third or fourth back, and buy Control Words, as many as you can, honestly. Whenever you get back to base, just buy Control Words. One last thing, here's a picture of usually where the enemies put place words, so you can look for them whenever you want to gank, and so on. Anyways, thanks a lot for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Too bad Shaco got nerfed, so the build kinda changed a bit, but I think that the no mythic build, it's still quite decent. You can actually even go for mythic as your fifth or sixth item. Thanks again for watching, and as always, until next time, stay safe. I didn't really trust my Eben